DelicateBeats.com. Hey, welcome back, guys. JT here for DelicateBeats.com. Does your copy of Logic Pro X look just like GarageBand? Maybe you've just bought it or maybe you've updated it to the latest version. If that's the case and it annoys you just like it did for me, let me show you how to fix that problem. So I've just opened up a session in Logic Pro X and as you can see there are these wooden sides on the interface and no ladies and gentlemen this is not GarageBand this is really Logic Pro X as you can see here in the menu. Um, there's also a bunch of stuff missing on the interface such as you know the grid features the information in the region box. So the easy way to solve this problem is to go in the Logic Pro X menu in preferences and click the advanced tools. In here you'll find this single checkbox to show the advanced tool and as I click it you see that all of the automation and the MIDI and a bunch of other stuff comes back in the interface you know the region has all this information and the drop down menus for the grid uh, snapping stuff come back in so hope this was helpful I know the first time I ran into this problem I was, I was very worried that you know uh, Logic Pro X had become you know this garage band hybrid but uh, no need to worry you know you, you still get the, um, the good stuff from uh, what you were uh, accustomed to in the previous versions of Logic Pro. So thank you for watching click the little thumbs up icon if you liked it subscribe to my channel and uh, on this note have a great day.